I'm Ju Yong An from Samsung Medical Center, Seoul, South Korea. I'm an interventional cardiologist. Aspirin has been recommended as a standard treatment in patients undergoing PCI after the standard duration of a dual antiplatelet therapy. However, evidence supporting aspirin is outdated and debated. Uh, therefore, clopidogrel monotherapy has been emerged uh, as a promising alternative to aspirin. So far, only one trial, the host exam trial, directly compared clopidogrel monotherapy versus aspirin monotherapy in patients undergoing PCI after standard duration of the APT. Uh, therefore, another uh, trial with adequate sample size, uh, especially focusing solely on the strict endpoints of heart disease, is necessary. Therefore, uh, we conducted the smart choice trial to compare clopidogrel monotherapy versus aspirin monotherapy in patients with high risk of recurrent ischemic events undergoing PCI after the standard duration of the APT. The SMART Choice 3 trial uh, was an investigator-initiated, uh, prospective, randomized, open-label, multi-center trial that was conducted in 26 sites in South Korea. Uh, we enrolled patients with high uh, risk of recurrent ischemic events, uh, in other words, prior MI, medication-treated diabetes, or complex PCI. Uh, patients uh, who underwent PCI and completed its standard duration in DAPT were randomly assigned to either receive clopidogrel monotherapy or aspirin monotherapy in a one-to-one -one fashion. The primary endpoint was a composite of all-cause death, MI, or stroke. Between uh, August 2020 and July 2023, 5,506 patients underwent uh, randomization. During a median follow-up uh, duration of 2.3 years, the cumulative instance of the primary endpoint was 6.6% in the aspirin group and 4.4% in the clopidogrel group. The difference was statistically significant. The benefit of clopidogrel was mainly due to reduction in myocardial infarction compared to the aspirin monotherapy. There is no significant difference uh, between the two groups in uh, the risk of bleeding. Upper gastrointestinal clinical events occurred less frequently in the clopidogrel monotherapy group compared with the aspirin monotherapy group. Uh, the most recent European guideline for the management of chronic coronary syndrome recommend aspirin monotherapy as well as clopidogrel monotherapy as class 1. However, in real world practice, aspirin is uh, predominantly used. After the smart choice trial, clopidogrel monotherapy should be considered as a first-line therapy, especially when the patients have a high risk of recurrent ischemic events. Uh, one of the limitations of our study uh, is that we exclusively enrolled Korean patients. Therefore, the results of our study uh, cannot be directly applied to patients from other regions, especially Western countries. So I hope another large randomized clinical trial uh, will be conducted in Western countries.